Hello, this is Dr. Ben Benham. I'm a board certified dermatologist. Today, I'm going to be demonstrating uh, stem cell therapy injections into the scalp. So the way we do stem cell therapy is that we first do a PRP and, uh, and then we add the stem cells to it. What PRP is, is that it's called platelet rich plasma, where we draw up about 25 to 30 mLs of the patient's blood and then we spin it in our centrifuge. So this is our centrifuge. Uh, PRP has gone through quite a bit of a lot of changes in the past 10 years. When we started doing it back in 2010, our centrifuge was really small and we would only uh, basically spend the blood uh, once. But the way we do it now, and in order to get much better results, uh, we actually take more of the patient blood out. Uh, this allows us to concentrate more of the growth factors. Then we also spin it twice in our centrifuge. We first do one spin, and then we do a second spin in order to get what's called the buffy coat. But doing the second spin for six minutes, it really allows us to concentrate the growth factors from the patient's blood much, much, much better. And this is why we actually see much better results. Also, our centrifuge is a lot bigger too. So we've changed our centrifuge, we do more spans, we take out more of the patient blood, and all of these have contributed for us to getting better results uh, when we do PRP. Uh, another very important step is that in the old days, back in 2010, 11, 12, uh, what we used to do is just basically do a PRP once and wait six months. Uh, but that's really not the best way of doing it. In order to be very effective in a PRP procedure, you want to do it consistently several times, typically about three to four times, about one month apart. Uh, that's what gives patients basically the best results. So uh, we have already done the PRP procedure on our patients. So I'm just gonna basically show this to you. So this is it. So basically this is the buffy coat. Sometimes it's a little bit yellower, sometimes uh, it's a little bit darker. It depends upon the individual. Now this is uh, actually stem cell uh, that we buy. The stem cell comes, uh, it's called, they're called mesocomal stem cells. Uh, they come from the human uh, placenta umbilical cord from females that are 36 to 40 weeks uh, gestational age, which means pregnant. Uh, the company gets the placenta after delivery and they purify it, they test it, and they concentrate basically the stem cells. And we buy the stem cells, it comes uh, with FedEx overnight to our office uh, on dry ice. And what we do is that once we have the PRP, the buffy coat from the patient, we mix these two together and that's what I'm going to demonstrate right now. So we mix it together before we inject it into the patient's scalp. Okay, so I'm going to remove the top here. I'm also going to remove this one from here. Then there's no more stem cells right in here. So we've already removed all the stem cells and transferred it right into here. Okay. Now we're going to transfer it into these vials. Okay. We have now transferred the stem cells into our PRP and mix it together. So this is PRP with stem cells. Uh, and now we're going to inject a bit into our patient's scalp. 